Back in December, mm -hmm. Attorney General William Tong joined us, if you remember, the great day at 9A Kitchen and showed off his amazing cooking skills. We had so much fun, we asked him to come back, mm -hmm. and he brought his sous chef, Renee, too. <laughs> Hello. Hey guys, Brandon sous chef. <laughs> All right, so today you're helping us celebrate the Lunar New Year. Happy New Year. Happy, Happy, Happy New, New Year. Year. Yeah. It's the year of the rabbit. Oh, oh good. So if you're 12 or 24 or 36 or 48 and so on, okay. it's your year. So oh, it's nope. a big year. So it's no, a lucky year? No, but my son's turning 12. <laughs> oh, He's a rabbit. All right. Oh, I and love it. So what does that mean, to be a rabbit? Is it, do you, do you, yeah, there are all these characteristics, you know. Like it's good luck. Clever. Not well behaved at dinner time. They eat. Kind of they thing. chew on your <laughs> electrical cord. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. They hop okay. around. Keep yeah. a little hutch outside. Oh my word! <laughs> so I thought I would come back and make a legit kung pao chicken. Oh, oh, God. You know, with all due respect, you know, not like supermarket no, kung pao it, chicken. No, and his yeah. family you know. knows. Remind him about your family's restaurant. So the Sampan on Celestine Highway in Wethersfield, not far from here, and. Um, you know, I learned to make a Kung Pao there, a legit Kung Pao, okay. you know, not out of a can. So I'm roasting peanuts here, and that's an important component of the Kung Pao chicken. Kung Pao is um, a Sichuan dish, so are we spicy? Do you guys eat spicy? Yeah, spicy. Right. 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 We'll yeah. be a little spicy. Here's the... <laughs> Here's the pepper that Ooh, I've, I've already, that's a lot of spice. I've already uh, pre-sliced. Uh, they call it the supermarket a, a, a Cubanel pepper. Cubanel pepper. Cubanel Cubanel pepper. pepper. Cubanel pepper. Cubanel it's pretty hot. Oh, I okay. forgot. He I, worked at a grocery store. Yeah. Oh, did you? <laughs> yes. So, so the first step is to prepare uh, a little marinade with the chicken. Okay. Okay. Because okay. okay. the chicken is cooked first separately, and I'll do that. Um, during your other segments. But we're going to add a little sherry. Ooh. Sherry! Sherry, baby! Sherry. The what kind of oil comes with the traditional doo-wop song exactly. while we prepare it. Wait, what kind of oil did you roast the peanuts in? Is that important? Just, no, just regular okay. Okay. peanut oil. Here's a little white pepper. Okay, okay. That's right. a lot of white pepper. Uh, <laughs> and then some salt. Uh -huh. Have you heard of white pepper? Okay. No? No. I've heard of knights in white satin. <laughs> but not white pepper. <laughs> not white no, it's good so you don't see the black I'm stuff. I'm going to add a little bit of light soy. Light soy. So light soy medium? versus dark soy. Oh, I didn't know there was a difference. Oh, yeah. It changes the, huh. the coloring yeah, I mean, of the then, dish. And then this gives a little Ooh. crisp. I'm going to add a little just cornstarch powder. Corn starch. Okay. You did that in the dumplings, yeah, too. Yeah, it was Yeah, made. yeah. You gotta, what like, does that do? It congeals things. Okay. But in this case, it'll give it a little crisp and texture mm. okay this looks mm. fairly simple to make but i'm sure it's simple well, well, you make magic it is so not good. simple magic is never simple <laughs> no. no it's is complicated this, is this a traditional new year dish so or? it can be okay um traditional new year dishes um, include dumplings but we already did dumplings yeah. so i couldn't do dumplings again um noodles mm -hmm. which are complicated over an induction stove in a TV studio. <laughs> so let me ask you, yeah, let we're me kind ask, of limited. Let me ask sorry. a horrible question. Uh -oh. does, does anybody eat Hassan pfeffer on, on uh, Chinese? Hassan pfeffer? Yeah, what rabbit. is that? It's rabbit. Oh, oh. oh. I've never had. I've well, never not had in the either. year of the rabbit. Not in the <laughs> no. Maybe in other years. Well, okay. it, it's horrible. Really, it wouldn't, it wouldn't be the rabbit with you. year if we were eating rabbit. What's you know what I mean? What is it? What did you say? Don't you know Hoffen Pfeffer? It's, it's German. Hoffen, I know yeah. Heffenreffer or Heffenef. Isn't that a, we're, a oh, beer? Oh, he's, oh, all right, he's adding more. Hefeweizen. <laughs> so, so because it's Lunar New Year, you have to give everybody a Lunar New Year greeting. Oh, okay. okay. So, okay. They're, you know, in multiple dialects, you can do that. But I'll give you the basic Mandarin version. Okay. okay. So it's Gong Shi Fa Chai. Gong Shi Fa Chai. Yes. Really yes. good. Gong Shi Fa Chai. Gong Shi. Gong Shi Fa Fa Chai. 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 Like T S. Chai. Chai. Gong Shi Fa Chai. Thai. 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 Yes. All right. We got it. Thai. There you go. Oh my gosh. That's so, so awesome. For like the next two weeks, just walk around Trader Joe's and like, go shi fa Exactly. Go shi fa Right? In like the frozen like... Chinese food section. Oh, that's awesome. 
What are some of the memories you have on Lunar New Year's? Like, where are some of the Apart special from traditions? The family fighting. <laughs> exactly. Well, every family does every that. Family but has what's, that, what's something yeah. special? Like, did you guys have things that you remember? Because I know in our families, in like New Year's, we have traditional things we do. But what do you do? So my grandmother, who's 98 years oh, young God bless. this year, God bless her. she was the heart of the New Year celebration. Okay. So oh. a lot of dumpling wrapping. Um, you know, a lot of time together. My sisters are coming in from all over with my nieces and nephews. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it's just a really important time. It's, the, it's actually the largest human migration in the world oh. that happens every year, oh, the Lunar really? New Year. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. in Asia. Oh. It's the largest movement of people at any one time. Oh, so, wow. so going to visit yeah, going, family. Right, and, going okay. home. So, you know, Thanksgiving and Christmas is big here in America and in the West, but there's just pound for pound more people in the world who move wow. over these next two oh weeks. Goodness. That's, never That's heard really incredible. Yeah. And and it happens in in um, China, it happens in Korea, it mm -hmm. happens in Vietnam. You know, it happens all over Asia, and it happens here in America. And there's so many Asian cultures that celebrate Lunar New Year, right? It's not exclusive to one particular right, culture. Right, right. Yeah. And, and they have different customs mm -hmm. um, and different traditions. We've got about a minute. Oh, let's go. Oh, what, do you well, need? So, what do you need? So just so you know, so we've mixed this up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. It's congealed. Um, <laughs> it is congealing. I'm going to... I'm gonna let this sit for a few minutes. Okay. We've got our peanuts. Yep. These are pre-chopped vegetables, um, including ginger. I brought the ginger root for everyone to see, and the Cuban all pepper. I've got ginger and garlic here. I'm gonna put all this together. Okay. For the main event, I'm gonna do a little stir frying on camera Ooh, later. Come back. And then. I, I brought the tong marital rice cooker. I thought oh, my this. wife was like, "What are you doing?" This is a huge. I thought this was a foot thing. massage. Don't touch that. Oh, Don't break it. Yes, Don't it's a touch it. Scott. That's it's the a marital rice maker. Respect. I thought it was a foot massage. Please I'm sorry. step away from the marital rice maker. Yes, the step that's away a marital that. rice maker. Okay. Or, or Scott breaker. Was gonna put his foot what in. does that mean, marital rice? Right it was given as a wedding gift. Oh, it's traditional. It's you don't want to mess with that. Big in Asian culture. So yeah, there's rice yeah. pre-made. Mrs. Tong made the rice for you last Ooh, night. Seriously? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Hello, thank you, Mrs. Tong. Oh yeah. All right. So we're gonna check in and judge back a little bit later with the Attorney General. Uh, but in the meantime.